you already have an area of life that you want to raise your standards in. For some of you, schoolwork. For some of you, self-love. For some of you, maybe your finances. For some of you, maybe how you process your negative thoughts or emotions, right? So, so having a specific area in your life that you want to raise your standards in and just focus on one tiny thing that you know is going to contribute towards that area. One tiny thing. Let's say if you want to lose weight as an example. You can lose weight by doing two things. You eat less and or you uh, exercise more. So the even if it's as simple as two things, it's still too complicated. So if you just commit to one thing, either you eat less or you exercise more, right? And then even that is still not specific enough. You see? So regarding a discipline, we want to make this as simple as possible. So how do you make it simple? You want to have a specific thing being executed at a specific time and at a specific place. Specific thing, specific time, specific place. Because when you have the specificity, then you know for sure if you execute it today or not, right? If you just say, I wanna exercise more. Okay, great, is 10 steps exercise more or a thousand steps, or is it 10,000 steps, or is it 20,000 steps, right? So ambiguity also makes a discipline fragile because it's confusing, you don't know what it is. So you wanna make it as simple as possible by having a specific thing that you execute at a specific time and a specific place. So one specific discipline around losing weight could be, I show up at the gym at 8 a.m. for one minute. You see, specific time, specific thing, specific place. And you know for sure if you hit that today or not. So if you're there for one minute at eight o'clock at the gym, your chosen gym for one minute, then it's a checkpoint. 